Absolutely, stress can be harmful to our health, as we know. And there are, in fact, two types of stress, good stress and bad stress. The term for good stress is actually eustress. It's spelled E-U-S-T-R-E-S-S, -S, a term coined by Hans Selye. So, and then distress, which would be the negative stress. And in fact, the body doesn't differentiate between good stress and bad stress. It releases the same hormones, uh, cortisol, adrenaline, noradrenaline, when we feel sensations of stress. So it's a matter of how we perceive it. If it's exciting versus feeling nervous, or if it's energizing versus scary. So for example, we need certain levels of stress in our lives, good stress, for example, um, to engage in competition. Uh, riding a roller coaster may evoke some good stress. Um, exercise, um, friendly competition, Childbirth even uh, is, is a stressful event, but it's a necessary stress to get, get the job done. So it comes down to how your body, um, well, your body responds similarly, but it's about how you perceive the stress. So what you decide to do with it, or you perceive it, has an impact on the emotional quality of it. So if something feels exciting to you versus scary, it's gonna have a different effect on your emotional well-being.